Okay, so first we have Python installed. Let me check running Python. Then uh, this is optional, but it helps to get the files, the pickle files from here. Just click download and browser. And then this gives you everything you need. I got them saved in e slash sg3 pre-trained. So this is all that I've got, all the pickle files. And then this new folder that we've got, we open it inside VS Code. create our virtual environment. Now we can see the virtual environment is here and here inside scripts I need to create a new folder called libs and inside this folder we need to copy uh, this file from our uh, Python installation folder. So wherever you installed Python, in my case it's C program files, Python 9.39 because I selected um, Uh, an, an installation for all users on the machine. I simply co uh, copied this over. So I've got this here now uh, because StyleGAN will ask for it later. Uh, okay, so we can now simply activate. Okay. Uh, we can run this activate. Now we can see that the uh, environment is active. And then I'll use Light the Torch to install the proper uh, version of PyTorch for my machine. This is easier than going to the uh, PyTorch website and going through the uh, steps there, but you, obviously you can do that as well if you prefer. Simply run this command, ltt, light the torch, install torch, and it will install the proper version of PyTorch for you. Okay, um, now to ins simply install the StyleGAN3 repo. And now it's on to the required dependencies. And finally, let's cd into the folder and use uh, the gen images script to generate some images and make sure you set your download folder. Uh, that you saved yesterday, save earlier, so that you saved to earlier. So for me, it's uh, e slash uh, sg3 pre trained. And here we have a bunch of nice animal faces. And that means we're ready to get on to the serious stuff.